Look at her trying to spit game at Jake. Girl, why you being so thirsty? Like, you see him working out with our girl. You being so thirsty. Jeez. All right, y'all. We are back. Episode two. So, today, we are going to be focused on, you know, going to work, getting that coin, and then, hopefully... Oh, pretty soon we can get our girl out of this homeless shelter. I mean, listen, it's not a bad homeless shelter though. Like, let's let's take a moment to appreciate. You got computers, you got laundry, you got showers, you got a place to eat. Like, it's not bad. It's not wait. Thank you. It's not bad at all. As far as homeless shelter goes, you she could do worse. She could do worse. So she has work in twelve hours, and then I think until then she's gonna go ahead and hit up jake to get some personal training you know although she did tell him maybe not today you know she's like you know what no let's not put it off let's uh because the more i put it off the more it ain't gonna happen so let's head to the gym and let's call up jake and let's get some personal training shall we so come on girl let's get up out of here and let's head to the gym because you're trying to get your life together we not gonna procrastinate we're not going to do that. So while she got some time, oh, girl, you ain't even got no workout clothes. Oh, my God. You want to work out in this. Girl, we need to get you some money so you can get some clothes. Like, oh, no. He's about to see her in the same outfit she was in yesterday. Oh, 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 oh. This is, yeah. Oof, girl. Listen, he already knows you're homeless. He already, like, you've been told him your whole life story. You spilled your guts to him while you were drunk. So, <laughs> at this point, what does it matter? <laughs> like, who cares? Huh. All right, let's go ahead and call Jake. Oh. Huh. oh, look at you. Already ready to go to the treadmill. I know that's right, girl. Get do your thing, girl. Do your thing. Oh, look at that. Jake is coming right on over. He's like, yeah, I'll meet you at the gym. Let's go do some training. Well, while you waiting on him to get here, let's go ahead and uh get you on this treadmill, girl. Where is you going? Who's you going to go talk to? Some random? Let's not do that. Y'all. Y'all, do y'all see this man? There go Jake. Do y'all see him? Where is he going? Oh, he going up there. That's fine. What, what you gonna do, girl, is you gonna come over here and work out on this treadmill. Work out together. Sure. Oof, child. This is this is embarrassing for you in the same outfit you was in yesterday. Oh, my God. Jake is just seeing you at your worst, girl. Don't worry, girl. The first thing we gonna do when you get some money after you complete your job is get you some fitness clothes. Y'all, do y'all see how fit Jake is? Like, no wonder he's a personal trainer. The guy is fit. Okay. She got to work out yesterday's clothes. Jake is looking at her like, oh, man, she is really, yeah. Jake is like, oh, it's good to see you taking, you know, taking workout serious like you said you was going to do. Now let's get this workout going. Let's get it in. Let's do it. He's like, you go. Can you train her? He's like, you know what? I'll join you. Even though he hates doing cardio. You know, he's a, he's a weightlifting guy. But you know what? Just to encourage her, he's going to do some cardio as well. Y'all, Jake don't even like doing cardio. He's a he's a weightlifting guy, clearly. But he's like, you know, I'll do some cardio just to encourage you to go and do your thing. Oh, look at them working out together. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, then. He's like, we got this. We're going to do this together. Look at her trying to spit game at Jake. Girl! Why you being so thirsty? Like, you see him working out with our girl. You being so thirsty. Jeez. Girl, did you already give up on a workout? She's like, you know, I got a nice little workout in, but I stink and I'm done. But look at her. Okay, she feels good from working out. She got in a good workout. She's feeling fired up and energetic. You gonna go swim? 
girl no you ain't even got no swimsuit like what it like girl you steady trying to do things you ain't got you ain't got no clothes girls oh child y'all both need to shower but anyways <laughs> tatiana's like thank you for you know working out with me and you know give me a little personal training but i think i'ma go and shower and then head out and he's like hey like i don't mean to put you on the spot but i did notice that like you're in the same clothes you were in yesterday and I know you like confided in me that you know your husband well your ex-husband kicked you out with only $100 and only the clothes on your back so I was wondering if I could you know well, why are you feeling flirty why is you feeling flirty around our girl Jake Jake are you Jake are you into our girl what's up Jake what's happening here you got a crush on my girl anyways He's like, yeah, so, I mean, like, not to put you on the spot, but, like, you know, if you if you want, I can get you, you know, some some outfits for you to work out in. And she's like, oh, no, I really don't want to take charity. I've had people take care of me my whole life. I really want to do this on my own. Don't you worry. I got a job, and I'm going to buy some workout clothes as soon as I get my first paycheck. And he's like, okay, like, you know, just just thought I'd offer. And she's like, okay, well, thank you. I'll see you, um, see you tomorrow. So right now, girl, go shower, cause you uh, you stink. So, yeah, she finna head off the shower, and so is he, cause he, oh goodness, he reeks as well. Y'all, I think, y'all, let me check something. Let me check something real quick. Does our dude, does he have a crush on? Oh, y'all, he finds her attractive. He finds her attractive, even with her hair all over the place in the same clothes from yesterday. He finds her attractive. Oh, <gasps> Jake, let me find out you got a crush on Tatiana. Jake, Jake, Jake. Let me find out you got a crush on Tatiana. Let me find out. Let me find out. Jake, dude. And the crazy thing is, if he do, Tatiana has no idea. <laughs> She is completely oblivious if this man finds her attractive. Matter of fact, she's pretty sure he doesn't. So the fact that he does a little bit, that would shock the mess out of her. Whoa, <laughs> why is you in a towel? Don't tell me you was on the bus in the towel. Girl, that's so trifling. That is so trifling. Oh my goodness, girl. Get it together. Would you please? Now where is you going? Why is you cleaning? Who cares? This is the outside. This is the homeless shelter. You know why you're here? Um, dang. The dumpster's freaking empty. Thought we could die for some deals. I guess not. That's fine. Or whatever. Alright, y'all. So let me tell y'all the plan she has right now for herself. She wants to make some money because it's currently spring. So in the fall, she's going to be starting school. And she's going to be, you know, trying to, you know, get her law degree and become a lawyer like she always wanted to do. But in the meantime, she needs to make money and get a get her own place. She might live in the dorms when she attends school, but mm, she don't really want to be, you know, 30 living in the dorms with a bunch of teenagers. But, you know, like if it's cheaper and easier, she will. You got to do what you got to do, you know. Huh, where are all the other homeless people at? <laughs> You know, it's fine. We got the place to ourselves. That's cool. So, yeah. So, right now, the plan is just to make some money, save up, and get her an apartment. And then, in the fall, she's going to start school. <laughs> oh, is he growling at us? Dude, can we just be homeless and get on the computer without being hit on? Thank you. Oh, my goodness. Like, we is just trying to get our life together. We is not looking for a new man. Jeez. All right, girl. Go sleep. Actually, no, hold up. Go take a nap. Because you only got a little bit before you have to go to work. You don't want to be late on your first day and get fired on your first day. Because we need this job, okay? We trying to save up money for our own place. We is not trying to be in this homeless shelter forever. Although, we do appreciate having a place to sleep, bathe, and eat. So, you know, we ain't gonna knock it too hard. Dang, 6 a.m. Whoo, child. 6 a.m. Oh my God. That hurt my soul to see. You know, I know you're getting hungry, but you just gonna have to eat at work. It's fine. You'll be okay.
work for Tatiana starts in an hour. That it does. That it does, girl. Don't be late on your first. Wait, where are you? Who are you talking to? Oh, you tipping her, girl. You ain't got. You ain't got money to be out here tipping people. You only got a hundred and five dollars. Oh my goodness. I mean, listen, I like that you're generous, but you ain't got generous money, okay? Remember, you ain't married to a professional athlete no more. You ain't got endless funds, girl. You got very limited funds. Jeez, like, can we not? Can we not? Oh my goodness. And where in the world is the... Where's the cafeteria person? Jeez, you know what? Okay, whatever. You just got to eat at work. It's fine. But just don't stuff your face with fast food because we trying to remember we trying to lose weight girl we trying to get ourselves together but in the meantime yeah have some fun on the computer sixteen an hour what kind of apartment is she gonna, gonna be able to afford at sixteen an hour oh how the mighty have fallen going from living in a penthouse to homeless shelter making sixteen an hour but you know what? You taking this on the chin. I'm I'm actually very I'm proud of the way you taking this. Like other people would have folded, but you was you doing your thing, girl. You got a personal trainer. You got a job. You got a place to lay your head at night. You know what? We're gonna be happy for the small wins. We're gonna be happy for the small wins. Go to work so you can get some money and finally be able to afford some workout clothes. Cause working out in this get up ain't it. It is not it y'all oh my god look at her and her little fast food uniform and she only made 64 dollars at work look at this y'all she only made 64 dollars that's crazy that's all you made that you only made 64 dollars tatiana how's he supposed to afford an apartment how's he supposed to afford an apartment and then you gotta go buy workout clothes so you can't even yo you can't even put this money towards your apartment because you need workout clothes y'all I was hoping we was gonna be able to get out of the shelter in like a couple of days but it's looking like we're gonna be here for a hot second <laughs> Tatiana I'm so sorry all right let's um let's head to the mall wherever that is because you need some you need to buy some clothes girl speaking of which let's uh check in with her friends because Y'all know they be worried about her. Let's go ahead and send a text over to Ava and Lana. Just let them know that we good. They don't even know like what's happening. They don't know that she, you know, has been kicked out. That she only got $169 to her name. Hello, 69. Anyways, um, or that she's currently homeless. The only person who knows is Jake, who is literally a stranger. Jake is literally a stranger to her and he knows all her business. He knows she's homeless. He knows she ain't got no money. <laughs> he knows about her divorce, that she's been kicked out. He knows everything about her. And she just met this man. Girl, that that liquor really made you spill all, all your business. Oh, my goodness. Jeez. <laughs> Anyways, let's head to the mall and get her some clothes. Because she needs some workout clothes. And she ain't trying to get caught in the same clothes again by Jake. Oh, why are you so uncomfortable? sore from work oh yeah yeah i bet you are yeah ovulation oh you're ovulating that's great anyways let's uh yeah let's have some mom okay y'all so i'm currently playing in a save file that i'm still getting together and i don't actually have a mall built unfortunately so we just gonna act like these stalls is the mall <laughs> that's what we gonna do instead so unfortunately, yeah, we just gonna say that she just came from shopping at the mall is somewhere behind us that we didn't get to see off camera. Oh, y'all, this guy, this guy, he's gonna play a role later. We not gonna meet him right now. She gonna act a bl like she don't even recognize him right now, but she actually knows him. She just don't remember that she knows him. But later on in the story, he's gonna come into play. So y'all, y'all keep an eye on this guy, this guy right here. Y'all see him? Yeah, he's gonna come back into play. Keep an eye on this guy. But for right now, she is like, yeah, just got through shopping, spent the <laughs> spent the, all the money I just made at my job. Speaking of which, let me go ahead and take that money away. She spent uh, sixty dollars to get some new clothes, workout clothes. So now she's back to one hundred and nine dollars. That's great. 
that is great to girl that is that I love that for you you have no money and you is just itching by slowly so so slowly and then you only got one more day of work oh no you got two that's great okay well you you sleepy so we're gonna head on back to the homeless shelter and let you go to sleep oh and she got some pajamas she got one pair of workout clothes and one pair of pajamas So, you know, slowly but sure, like we said, we're going to be happy for the small wins, huh? We're going to be very happy for the small wins. Oh, our girl. You know, like I said, we're going to be happy for the small wins. I mean, you know, at least you got clothes to sleep in now. And listen, despite the fact this is a homeless shelter, I mean, like I said, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. And this freaking cook don't ever show up to do his job. Jeez. Like what? Time to water your plate in your cookbook. Let's sample some of the food at the Spice Festival. Oh my God, we can get free food at the Spice Festival. Yes, yes, we will. We will come. We will meet you there. Oh no, wait. Nobody's supposed to see her. Shoot, 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 shoot. It's her dad. You know what? She gonna tell him she couldn't make it, but she actually is gonna go and get her some free food. <laughs> but she is just going to avoid her parents like the plague. She's like, listen, I, I do need I do need that free food, but I don't want you seeing me like this, daddy. I'm sorry. He thinks she's not coming, but she gonna be there. She's just gonna avoid the shit out of him. Okay, what can you eat, girl? Let's see. Cause you hungry we gotta get you something that's within your diet because you're trying to trying to get your ish together let's see what we get what we got here we got a sweet and sour pork nigiri chicken burrito yeah i don't know how to say that word <laughs> and then some more sweet and sour pork um you know what sushi's kind of healthy yeah go grab a serving of the sushi Oh no, you gotta pee as well. That's great. That's, you're just so uncomfortable. I know. That's crazy. Where are you? Girl, why your fro be missing in action sometimes? Like, can we get our hair back? Hello? Okay, there we go. Speaking of hair. Yeah, she's gonna have to take some of her money and get her hair braided because she just, she just can't deal with her hair right now. She got too much hair and she's just gonna get that bad boy braided up while she get her stuff together. Oh, look at that. You wanna make a friend? Should we should we introduce ourselves to her? Nah, you ain't trying to be bothered. You just trying to get your stuff together. <laughs> Looks like Tiana is having a better job with those chopsticks. She should eat more chopsticks food like Nigari. Girl, are you telling me you can't eat? <laughs> are you telling me you can't eat the food? Eat your food, girl. Then go have some fun. You know, while we here, yeah, let's have some fun while we here. What can we do for fun? Sample food at this festival. Can we uh get a pack lunch? Sample food. Grab a serving port. No. Dang, we can't put it in our inventory or do anything. That's great. That is so terrific. Now, what can we do for fun here? Because our girl needs some fun. You ain't got tipping money. And you bet... Hmm. Is there any? Oh yeah, come dance to this music, girl. Yeah, come dance <clears throat> and have some fun. Nobody's around to see. We slowly overcoming this depression, one little bit by little bit. Get it, Tatiana. Get it, girl. I mean, you ain't really doing much, but you know, still get it. I mean, there's not really music you can twerk to, so it's fine. <laughs> you do it what you can. You're working with what you got. Oh, look at that. She likes the music. Is this country? What's this? Analyze the book. You know what? Yeah, let's keep that. Cloud gaze with your mom. Oh, you miss your mom. I know. I know. Listen, as soon as you, you know... 
start getting back on the good foot. We gonna we gonna reach out to all our people because I know you miss them and they miss you. Speaking of which, let's uh let's send a text to your mom since you miss her. Go ahead and send a text to your mama. Okay, get down, girl. Get down, Miss Ma'am. Y'all, look at her slowly overcoming her depression. Love to see it. She like, listen, we gonna go into the 30s the right way. I know that's right. Get it, girl. Go ahead and see your mama text. I know you miss her. Ooh, got to pee. <laughs> Wait, can we pack a lunch of this? Look at this. Yo. Chiprani. Grab a servant. Wait, what can we No. <laughs> We're not gonna do that, okay? Oh, you can sample all this food? Okay, you know what? Use the bathroom and then when does your shift start? In ten hours? Are you sleepy or anything like that? No, you're good. Look, y'all, look at her. Uproot plant, no. Can we harvest all this stuff? You know what, yeah, let's go harvest all. <laughs> Give us these fruits and vegetables. So when we, when we ain't got money for food, we got stuff to eat, okay? Yes, girl. Acquired the gardening school skill, that's great. Yep, I'm taking all this. We need things we can eat. What in the world is this? Oh, got some diet in here. Don't know why. Y'all, look at the pictures of her and her friends. Oh my goodness. Look at her little album of friends. What's this? Why is it all... Okay, goodbye. Oh, that's sweet. Wait, should we attempt this curry challenge? Nah, we shouldn't. Where are you going? Who are you talking to? If you about to tip him, girl, you ain't got tip money. Y'all, look at that. I didn't even have to tell her. She just started working out on her own, playing some basketball. And look, she already started to lose a little bit. You already lost a little bit, girl. Already. That's crazy. You only been working out for like a day. You already lost a little bit of weight. Okay, I see you. I see you, Miss Ma'am. Let me find out you got a fast metabolism. Okay, let's watch you try and fail. Oh, girl. <laughs> okay, you definitely did not play basketball in school. <laughs> but you know what? A for effort. A for effort. Get your workout in. Should we invite Jay to come play? You know what? No. No, let's not bother him. <laughs> we good. Shoot some hoops, girl. Shoot the hoops. Shoot around. Practice dribbling. Um, dunks. Oh, fitness level two? Look at you. Okay. You know what, let's shoot around a bit. Let's see if you can make some hoops. You got some skills to make these hoops? Let's see. Oh, girl. <laughs> uh, I mean, you made it, so yay. You did. Oh, snap. Her ex husband is a freaking professional basketball player. You know what? We should hate. Should we start hating basketball just because that fool is a basketball player? Should we do it? We don't want nothing that connects us to him. Nothing. Not a thing. You know, girl. You're carrying this weight in all the right places, girl. <laughs> I hate to say it, but you are. Girl, nothing but buckets. I know that's right. All right, you know what? You've had your fun. Let's uh head on back to the homeless shelter. <laughs> you know what? Actually, why you got some time? You might as well just head on to the gym. Since you in a fitness mood, yeah, let's go to the gym. Since you was feeling good about some fitness. And you did tell Jake that you would, uh, that you would meet him there today. So let's go ahead and head to the gym. Travel. And let's bring Jake with us. Oh, 
Oh, Jake is sleeping. That's great. <clears throat> um, Jake, you're supposed to be our personal trainer, homie. He's sleeping uh -huh. at 11 p.m. Y'all, yes. look at our girl. She is really serious about this fitness thing. Like, come on, let's do some cardio on your favorite machine. This is your machine. You claim it. This is yours. And since Jake is apparently sleeping, I guess we're on our own today. That's great. Work it out, Miss Ma'am. Get it. Look at our girl, y'all. She is really trying to get her life together. I admire that so much. You get it, girl. Get your workout in. Y'all like her new workout outfit? She got some new shoes too. Work it out, get your workout in. Look at her, she looks great. Her skin is all clear and whatnot. I'm so proud of you, Tatiana. Oh, you got work in six hours, girl. Get your workout in and go shower and then let's, let's get on, okay. Let's uh let's get you a shower, shall we? I think you did you did good. And then once you built up some stamina, we're gonna start trying to cycle. Y'all look at the little cycling class. I can't wait until she can try this after she get her fitness up some. Well oh, Look at you. Girl, how'd you even get it to move? <laughs> That's crazy. Oh my goodness. Alright, after you have a little shower, we gonna head on out. Head on back to the homeless shelter. Okay, y'all. Our girl is just sleeping. She has work in four hours. Yeah, woo, That's great. But so far, so good. She's doing good. She's been keeping on all her fitness stuff. She's making time for work, fitness, having some fun. She, our girl is working her way out of her depression. We love to see it. All right, she got two hours until work now. And I think when she gets home from work, we're going to like scope and see uh, what apartment she can afford. Right now, she can't afford nothing. <laughs> she can't afford nothing. All right, our girl's on her way to work. Um, you and not you in your pajamas, girl. You gonna change your work or something? Okay, I guess that's fine. You do you, boo. Finna go make her money, her her little little bit of money. Uh, where are you going? Well, where have you gone, girl? What roundabout way is you taking to get to work? You is late. Oh, you taking the subway? Okay. All right, y'all, our girl is back from work. And right now we is just looking to see what kind of apartments she could possibly afford, which is nothing at the moment, like nothing. <laughs> First of all, er everything has people in it, which is just great. Let's see, can she afford this bad boy? 10,000, oh no, oh, oh, deposit is 500. Weekly rent is, 400 yeah no she definitely cannot afford that right now let's see what other apartments are available there's got to be something loud neighbors yeah no okay oh here we go Okay, so 910 Medina Studio. This is the apartment she's trying to get right now. The deposit is $500 and the weekly rent is $400. Um, yeah, we might need to get a second job because right now, yeah, she ain't got those funds. She ain't got those kind of funds. She only has $175 because she just got home from work and yeah, that's definitely not enough to afford an apartment. <laughs> 
So next episode, we're going to be working on trying to hustle. Hustle to get this money so she can get an apartment. Because right now, she, you know, she's over the homeless shelter. She's only been there for a couple of days, but um, she's over it. Yeah, she's ready to get her own place, ready to move into her own place. So that is our goal. Alright y'all, I will see y'all in the next episode, which hopefully should be available in the next day or two. And we are just going to be grinding it out the next episode so we can hurry up and get our girl an apartment, okay? So she get an apartment, still focus on her weight loss journey and focusing on being, you know, getting over her depression. But so far, things are looking good. So far, things are looking good. She misses her friends, so she really want to hurry up and lose this weight so she can see her friends again. And I really can't wait for y'all to meet them as well. So I will see y'all next time. Bye.